I'm absolutely delighted now to be joined by Dr. Susan Coppersmith. Dr. Coppersmith, welcome. Thank you. Thank you for taking the time to talk to us today. Well, thank you for having me. So you're doing two sessions this week, a talk today and a, a talk on Thursday. Tell us a little bit about some of those sessions. Yeah. Okay, so today, I'm Monday, I'm talking about biomineralization and that is a process by which um, um, minerals are sort of put together to make strong structures and, and biological structures. So for us, we're used to it with uh, bones and teeth, but I'm actually going to talk about seashells mm. and how seashells are put together. It turns out the organization's a little simpler, so that's why we started the simpler structure. And it's a really fascinating field because it's been studied for hundreds of years, but it's new to physics. And so it's a really exciting to sort of figure out which physics simple views can be used to understand the complexity of the structures of these shells. And um, so we made a little progress on one particular uh, um, uh, bio, bio mineral called uh, nacre, which is in the inside of um, some seashells. Very strong, and the mystery is wh why is it so strong? But in order to understand that, you also have to understand the structure and how the structure is put together. And so that's what we worked on. And um, so that's a really fun field, and I'm looking forward to meeting all the other people working in the field because uh, it's just a bunch of people coming in and doing that. On Thursday, I'm actually talking about something completely different, uh, quantum computing. That's a contributed talk. And uh, also, there's a lot of exciting work. It's a, real, it's a really interesting field with a lot of progress. And so I'm, I'm really excited to meet people from all over the world. We're having collaborators from Brazil, and um, people are here from China. And, wow. and so it's, it's really fun. So, um, so for me, it's great, because it's the only meeting where both things are there. And that's one of the great things about the March meeting is the breadth. You say that, and you're saying about people coming from all over the world, and, and, and we're here yeah. in front of the Starbucks, you can see that. There's, yeah. there's people, a lot of different people. And so the meeting has real breadth, uh, doesn't it? So yeah. you must really enjoy that part of it. Well, I like the breadth of the topics and finding out what's new in areas that are far from uh, what I've been working on. And also I enjoy seeing people, because I'm now old enough that there are people I haven't seen in 20, 30 years, and I, I run into them in the hall there. And, it's one of the reasons I come back all the time is because of the people who I get to see who I haven't seen in such a long time. Makes it quite a special meeting. Oh yeah, for me it's really special. So as well as uh, giving the, the talks and all the research that you've been doing, you've also been chairing a, a, a group this year, haven't you, on uh, statistical and nonlinear uh, physics. Tell us a little bit about yeah. that. Well, it's the topical group on statistical and nonlinear physics and um, it's, a, it's actually a great, a great group. with real. It's a really friendly group and uh, sort of amazed when I first came in and um, just the business meeting has food. <laughs> <laughs> so if you want to join the topical group, we, we, we welcome you and you'll get free food. Um, that's what your dues go to is food. Anyway, um, but the, the research in that area, in, in, the, in the topical group is again very interesting, very diverse and it's really sort of fun to try to um, uh, promote the research in the group and to organize it. So a big part of what the group does is just sort of organize the sessions for the March meeting and, and, and just sort of promote them and tell people about them. And so it's, it's actually really nice. Well, Dr. Coppersmith, thank you ever so much indeed for joining us today. We appreciate that and we hope you have a great week. So great. thank you. Thank you.